Hey guys, this is a mechanic task guide for the developer secrets part two. For this task, we have to unravel the secrets of the IT firm employees high morale on streets of Tarkov. And then we do have to survive an extract from the location. So for this task, we will require the relaxation room key, which can be found in the pots and bags of scabs, as well as in jackets or in drawers, or you can always buy it from the flea market for usually between 300 and 400 K. But there actually is a 100% spawn chance for this key in the IT building on streets of Tarkov, where we did have to go for the part one of this task line. And I will end up showing you guys all 12 of these spawn locations at the end of this video, just so that if you guys do already have the key, then I won't waste any more of your time, or at least you will be able to see what to do once you do find this key right off the bat. So here's the map of streets in to locate the Hive Club and use the relaxation key. Then we will be going in the alleyway that's in between the damage house and the Sewer River PMC extracts. And my PMC will be starting just outside the big cinema. So my PMC is here on streets and this is where the big cinema is located. And then the damage house extract is going to be right down this way. And as we do turn to our left and then start moving down this road, then on the right hand side, you will see a fluorescent pig sign up above a door that says the Hive. And this is where we can use the relaxation key. Now, if you are here for the developer secrets part two task, then you will get a subtask complete just from entering into this hallway on the far side of this room. And then you will just have to survive an extract from the location to be able to hand this task over to mechanic. But if you do happen to die in between finding the room and then extracting, then you will have to come back and then just successfully extract from a raid on streets to be able to complete the task with mechanic. But since we are going to be inside of this room, then I definitely recommend that you check out the loot that has spawned inside of this area for you, because you will be able to get moonshines or whiskeys or even vodkas on any of the tables, as well as valuable spawns on each one of the chairs or couches, which does include bitcoins, a bunch of the new Funko Pop figurines, and there is also a bunch of duffel bags around, which does seem to have a high probability of spawning GPUs, as well as other high tier loot. And with some of the screenshots and videos that I have seen of people looting this room, then it is 100% worth it to check it out if it isn't already looted. And now I will show you guys the 12 potential spawns for the relaxation key so that you can find the key and get the task done without having to spend hundreds of thousands of rubles on this key yourself just be aware that because this key is highly sought after right now and that the loot in the actual it building is very good where the key spawns that this place is an absolute war zone right now now the inside of the it building was made accessible with patch 14 which is located on streets by the school x-ray and check 15 buildings and now i will show you guys all the potential spawn locations in a raid so my PMC is starting outside the IT building. This is where the Check 15 building is. The vet clinic is going to be right here. And then the school is going to be just to the right of it. So if we do turn around and then head inside this iron fence area, then we will have two access points into this IT building. Then once you get inside, then you will have a small conference room on your right hand side. As you enter into this conference room, then there will be a whiteboard on your left. And in the chalk holder is where the first potential spawn location is. And to the right of the whiteboard is going to be a door that leads into Nikita's room. Once you do come inside of here, then you do want to go to the left where there will be a spawn in the bookshelf next to the pink box, which is three shelves down from the top. There is also going to be a spawn directly across from this bookshelf inside of this weapon locker hanging from the door. Now in between the weapon locker and the bookshelf, there is another door and this leads into Nikita's bathroom. And in the far left corner, there is a hookah with a key that spawns on the very top part of it. After checking these spawns, then we are going to head back out through the conference room and then we're going to take a right and then another right and at the end of this hallway, then there will be a locked door. This locked door will require the negotiation key to unlock and this key can be bought on the flea market for usually between 15 and 20k. So if you do have the key and you are able to open up the door, then the location of the key spawn is going to be on the metal table on the far left side, just in the center of it. Now after you've checked the spawn or if you don't have the key, then you can turn around and then continue down the hallway to the first office on the left. Now inside of this first office on your left, there is going to be two spawns. The first one being directly on your left inside this magazine, just next to the first monitor. And then the second spawn will be at the far end of this room on the middle part of this coat rack. After checking these two spawns, then you can head back out to the hallway and then take a left. And then inside of this middle office where there will be two additional spawns to check. And both of which are going to be in the back right corner. The first one is going to be in between the teeth of the skull on top of this desk. And then the other spawn is going to be on the other desk just to the left of this in the center of the room. And it will basically be at the crotch of this figurine standing here. After checking these two locations, then there is actually a potential spawn for the negotiation room key in this same room. And it is going to be over here on the desk underneath of this pig. So after checking this as well, then you can head back out to the hallway and then take a left. And then we are going to go into the third office room on the left hand side, where there is going to be one potential spawn location on the desk just to the right and it is going to be to the right of the umbrella inside of this triangular terror group card thing. Now, after checking this location, then you can head back out to the hallway and then take a left. And at the end of the hallway, there will be a closed door that leads to a kitchen. Inside of this kitchen, once you enter, then immediately on your left, there is a washing machine with two bags on it. And on the front right corner, then that is where one potential key spawn location is in this room. Now, the second potential spawn inside this room is on the table behind the pizza box next to the hookah. 
And this is the 12th and final key spawn that we are aware about at this time. So hopefully you guys found this guide useful and did help you to complete this task. Thank you guys for choosing my video to watch on this and I hope that you have a fantastic rest of your day. So what you're seeing on the screen right now is just a couple of my different social links in case you guys wanted to connect more easily. I am primarily streaming on Twitch now multiple nights a week. So if you do want to connect with me or my community, that would probably be the easiest way to do so. And if you do come over to the Twitch and you want to join the Discord community, then just type exclamation point Discord or cord in the chat in order to get an invite link. And if you don't use Twitch, then I do have a link in the picture as well as a link below in the description. And we are growing and currently have an active and welcoming community with people of all experience and skill levels. So there will always be someone who could help to answer any questions that you may have. As always, thank you guys so much for stopping by and watching the video, and I hope that you have a fantastic rest of your day.